Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to this room tour slash setup tour for 2018. In my stream recently, a lot of people have been asking like, Hey, Nicholas, what keyboard do you use? What mouse do you use? What microphone do you use? What's your setup like? How does your room look? Blah, blah, blah. You know? Instead of showing people like every time they ask, I'll just link them to this video where I show them everything. Hopefully this video will <laughs> answer all your questions about what gear I use, like how my setup looks like and what my room looks like yeah yeah I guess that's the intro let's get right into it I think we'll start with like the, the less interesting and then work, work our way up to the main part which is over here we'll get to it all right all right just be patient be patient by the way it's not very big like there's not too much to go through so uh, but I mean I'll show you I'll show you what I got first corner is this corner come in here through the through this cool door this is my bedroom by the way in here but you know I, like it's a normal bedroom and I got a normal bathroom and a normal kitchen nothing nothing special to see all the good stuff is in this room so this is the only unique thing so let's get back into it this is so this is the chilling corner of the room right you got the nice couch you can lie down and relax lots of pillows because i love them pillows this flag by the way i got that flag in tomorrowland or i bought it at home and i used that tomorrowland that was pretty dope by the way i want to go back and this is my whiteboard this is where i write down all my ideas and things i have to do i've covered it up with like a fancy projector screen which i can pull down because there's a lot of stuff on it that I can't really show people. There's like a non-disclosure, is that what it's called? I don't know what it's called. I think that's what it's called in English. Where I can't show you the names and stuff and I've written down all the names on this. So, can't show you that. But yeah, that's my whiteboard of ideas right there. That's how I get my days done. Let's get back. I'm, I'm, I don't know why I'm talking so so much. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just trying to show you my room. Over here we got the messy corner. I have no idea what that painting is. I just found it in the house somewhere. So I was like, you know what? I need some decoration in my room. So I took it. This is also from Tomorrowland. This is my graduation diploma. It says that I have a bachelor. I paid like $50,000 for this and I haven't used it yet. Hopefully I'll, I'll need that bachelor in the, in the future though. Anyways, and then we just got like, I've even written down, that's how organized I'm trying to be. Chargers and pens, cables and all, all that kind of shit, all documents I need and contracts and stuff and camera gear and microphone gear and guitar gear. Why am I filming my face? I should show this. It's all locked away in that corner. So that's just my messy corner of all the things that I need. And next to it is my old chair. Um, I guess that's that corner, it's not very special. And then this, this is pretty, this is pretty cool. Even though it's very shady at the same time. So if you can see the whole thing. Ah, so this is in the other side of the room. And it's like a homemade uh, recording box, I guess you could say. It's obviously not the best in the industry, but it does its job. It does what I want it to do. I put some cozy lights in there so you get into the zone. There's supposed to be a microphone and a microphone stand right here. And then there's like Ikea carpets on the walls around and on top so that the sound doesn't like bounce. Because if I go in here, you can probably hear that my voice is a lot more, like you can't hear an echo. You know, so that's the whole point of the carpets and everything. If I go out here, suddenly my voice is different. So it does its job, and that so that's the recording booth. High quality recording booth. So now we're getting to the good stuff. Now all the boring stuff's out of the way. We'll start here. So I've got some. These are getting pretty old, but they're perfect. They're Rocket Six from KRK. This I've built myself with some help from my dad, like a, a stand made of wood and then I put like some uh, I don't know what you call this home under the speakers so the bass doesn't like shake through the house too much it actually works pretty well and it sounds better for me as well because the bass doesn't shake in the walls I use these a lot when I'm mixing my my, my songs this is what my setup looks like Ta da so we got the the good chair that you see me sitting on on stream here's that microphone stand I was talking about that uh, that was in the recording booth so I've got this screen on a stand which is very nice I can also pull this uh, I've got a very simple sound card that I use in the corner this is where I put my chat and everything that's not as important I put it on top of my computer so that it's almost at the same level as the other one so I don't need to be looking down uh, and behind here a light and I put this up because the lights so goddamn bright this is my 
my keyboard. Honestly, I don't know what it is. It was a cheap brand. I had a Razer Black Widow, but uh, I spilled Red Bull all over it a week ago. So I went to the shop last minute before I, just, like, I was gonna stream and just bought the cheapest mechanical keyboard they had. Like this mouse I've had for years and it's never let me down. It's a Razer Naga Molten Core. Yeah, that's what it's called. And it's got like 12 buttons on the side, so when I play Fortnite it's pretty nice. So here you got the beasts. This big one, I've had it for like, I don't even know how long, like eight years or some shit. But that's what I use for music, because I've got all my files on that, and it does the job, so I'm happy. I'll use it until it dies, probably. It's died a few times, but I've <laughs> changed the processor a few times and stuff. But for gaming, it sucks ass, because the graphic card is way too, way too old. And that's where this baby, this is the streaming slash gaming computer. That's the newest one. That's like a year old or something. <laughs> so that's, that's about it, guys. That's my whole setup. Pretty dope, right? But yeah, anyways, thank you for checking out this video. If you came from the stream, go jump back into the stream. I'll leave the link in the description so you can just jump back. Um, remember to subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed it. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for watching the video. And hopefully I'll see you in the next one. See ya!